Got to set up my mic. Hey, what's up guys? How's my voice? Can you hear it? Anyways, let's see. Let me make a tweet for my stream. I miss you guys too. I miss you too, Chris. I don't know. I feel like I'm just in a dark time of my life right now. Since, I don't know. Puyo's just getting oppressed so much. I want Puyo to succeed, but it's just so hard. But I believe in us. I think if we work together, we can get somewhere. Okay. Oh, thank you for hosting me, Chris. <laughs> Sorry. It's feeling kind of broken on the inside. Anyways, let's play uh, Puyo Puyo Tetris. All right. Oh crap. How come my field isn't showing up? That was weird. Thankfully the guy had was nice enough to just like let me not get punished. Oh. What's he doing? I guess I'll try sealing it off. Oh, I think this is good enough? Don't know how they'll dig out of that. Hey Saker, yeah, it's been forever. I don't know, I just really needed time to recover emotionally after, you know, the dreaded Crown's patch announcement. Like, Puyo did not become sh Not only did Puyo get like, screwed around with, it's still not enough to beat Tetris. So I don't know, I just had a very tough moment in my life where I'm just like, what am I even doing? Like, how am I going to keep fighting when the world is like clearly against us? So, I had a lot of things to do over the weekend. Uh oh No, I should react earlier. Oh, you like my new profile picture? Yeah, Tucker drew it. I'm so happy. I'm really happy for my family. It's the only thing that really keeps me going, <laughs> to be honest. Oh my gosh. Oh. oh, dang it! I should have popped the reds. No, hey, Alta. Oh, you've been eating lots of uh, Tetris players, but I bet it was tedious and not fun at all, right? Unless you have a really twisted sense of fun. Like, banging your hand against a wall, fun. I guess it's okay. I guess I shouldn't judge. Spinning! I think this should be good enough. Spinning. Oh, 
Oh, it's actually getting kind of cold in here. I can wear my cape. I can wear this now without burning this stuff. How do I look, guys? Like a professional Puyo player? Professionally anime? Oh, oh crap. Mm. I wouldn't say I sealed them just yet. Oh, what? They gave up? A race. But don't you like punishing bad setups and beating your opponent and having it actually, you know, mean something? Gosh. No. Mm, he's wasting lots of resources on just these pokes, so I set off my chain. Okay, that was the right call. Should my magical 12 chain powers? I don't know. I haven't really played Puyo in a whole week, so I don't know if I can do it. Hmm. Well, the reason why I don't play Puyo vs Tetris is that it perpetuates the idea that it should be played. When really, it's not good. But that's just me. I guess I can't really dictate what other people should be doing, so... <laughs> Oh gosh, that was- I just sat there and let it hit me. Oh my gosh. <laughs> mm. Let's see. They're chained. It's not- why are they wasting so many pieces? That's kind of weird. Oh. Oh, why did they do that? Um. Oh gosh. Spinning. No. Okay, let me try better next round. I didn't really know what the heck he was doing the first time. Maybe I can react better this round. Oh? What was that? No greens are coming up. They're not ready. Alright, I've got this. There we go. Hmm, just make a 7 chain, you say. Well, good luck once you hit the 1500 or 15,000 range where you start fighting Amamiya and all the other Tetris players. Oh gosh. 
They're not even set back that far for doing that. I'm in big trouble here. Oh, actually, the way they cut that, I might survive. Hmm. What? How am I gonna... Well, there is no surviving that. Well, can wait for my next match. Hey, Cuber, Cubrian Gamer, is that where your name is? Thanks for following. No, where is everyone? I just want to match. Does no one like to play swap mode anymore? Oh, Cuber, okay. Oh, where is everyone? <laughs> I'm so lonely and sad. Oh, hey, you're on Puyo, I mean, Puyo Tetris. Do you want to play? Hmm, they've done a weird setup. If I rush, I might be able to get this. Maybe. Oh, hey Casey, what's up? Oh my gosh, I couldn't counter. If only I had made my thing longer. Mm. I don't think I should be trying to fight those harassments though. Seems like, it's like they're committing a lot. So if I just set off my chain and response, I might be able to just get the win anyways. Maybe. Oh. Mm, gotta pressure the trigger on the right. Or no, it's on the left. Wait, okay, this should seal it? Or we set them back. Okay. Can't fight against that anymore. <laughs> yes! Okay, I think I reacted decently there. That was a big commit for them. Can't catch up now. Hey, Tino Salsa. Huh? Splatoon 2 got an update? Of what? What happened? Will the Puyo competitors seen ever show up at tournaments without Tetris? I don't know. Whoa, what? Six? Hmm, I mean, maybe not for the next three years or so. People just don't like Puyo. And all we can do about that is for us to keep playing and improving and trying to inspire whoever we can.
Oh, dang it. No! I didn't mean to set the chain off. That was an accident. Oh my god. Hmm. Sorry for the anime. What do you mean? Okay, trigger isn't ready. Hopefully this is fast enough. Oh, I think I've got this. A ragtag group of wacky students. But then you awaken to your personas and you change the hearts of people who crap on Tetris or crap on Puyo without even knowing anything about it. I think that's what my ideal high school life would be. Changing the hearts of people who hate Puyo for no reason. Will it force him to do something with this? Ugh. Oh no. This is all I can do. I can't survive those two lines. You watch Persona 4 the animation? It's okay. All the bad animation moments are always really funny. Like, have you guys seen that picture of the two GAs in one scene? It's so hilarious. I wonder how that happens. What causes animators to slip up like that? I guess being human is a reason. Hmm. Whoa, what? Is another attack coming up? Oh no, that's pretty strong. Not right there. No, no, no. Oh yeah, I heard of- I think I read one- I read like this one uh, news article about the insane working hours for like animation studios. Or you like- or basically like anything in Japan. They work crazy hours. It's so unhealthy and unsafe. But that's what they believe they have to do to succeed. I guess everyone else who's just like equally competitive and sacrificial. Okay, I can't win against this harassment. Wait, what? Is this gonna be good enough? I don't think so. What happened to the car bubble next to me? Um, oh, I put it up. Oh, this isn't strong enough. I'm so sad. There's just so much more power in it. I'm like really bad at Puyo Puyo Tetris now. What game am I actually playing? Hmm? Okay. Could have rushed me there, but they didn't do it, so. Well, they're trying to harass with the left side. That's a three chain. What do I have? Just got a follow up. Okay. That means I survived it pretty well. Are you gonna attack more? Oh man, what do I do? I'm stuck! Oh no! Oh. Uh. 
実力が違うやんうん、oh, yeah, um, I've been practicing the boss, the chemical plant zone, act two, quite a bit. Basically, the only thing I do when I play Sonic Mania. Mm. How about this? Okay, I have a long chain. I don't think they're expecting this. Let's see. I can do a new form. How about Tanaka special? Two lines? Okay. I don't know if I should have gambled on the- Oh, what? Everything breaks! Okay, hope this is good enough. Alright! Oh hey, hey, he's Maduna. Yeah. Soft mode is one of my favorites to play in Puyo Puyo Tetris. Because you actually have to play both Puyo and Tetris. Like, who knew, right? Pretty revolutionary. Although, it turns out that really, all that's really valued in swap mode is like Puyo or Tetris skill. Being good at Puyo is not as important as being ultra fast in Tetris. It makes me a little sad, but oh well, beggars can't be choosers. We can't just ask Sega to release a real Puyo game. Just gotta suffer with what we have. Mm, do I have a story as how I got the username Cool Softener? Well, my original name was S2, or Stupid, but I thought it would be amusing to make more puns off my name, so one day I was just like, hey, I'll be Stool Softener. Hmm? Well, if you look at the 2015 Red Bull 5G, where they read, well, I guess you can't watch the, the video anymore. It got deleted. But the year that the Red Bull 5G ran swap mode, basically everyone who got to the finals were Tetris players. And none of them were making, trying really hard to make real Puyo chains. None of, like, there were not any, like, normal Puyo players who managed to qualify. Since like the Tetris presence was so overwhelming, I think that's why they changed up how people qualify for their later tournaments. I mean, I'm not sure what you mean to say by like comparing like US or whatever scenes. Because the representation you see at the tournaments right now are people who don't really have any investment at all in playing Tetris. Like, they don't see it as a competitive game. So they're not going to be good at that either. Okay. 
Oops, I messed up my tail. Hope you don't hope you don't notice. Actually, what were they doing? Oh. No, I reacted too late. <laughs> Damn. Do I like Super Monkey Ball by any chance? I've never played it before. Oops, no, this isn't all clear anymore. What have I done? Oh wait, this does all clear. Oh cool, that was nice. I realize that people don't actually understand your argument when you point out that the top 20 is mostly Tetris. They're just like, well, of course it's going to be like that. Tetris is more popular than Puyo. I mean, that's, that's true, but they, they kind of ignore the fact that if Puyo really did have an, overwhel like an overwhelming advantage, there would be like at least some Puyo players who end up being at the very, very top, right? But that doesn't exist. It's all Tetris. But people don't really care enough about Puyo Puyo or Tetris to really think that far. Man, they keep digging. Oh, Tucker! Hello! How are you? I'm wearing my Amity hat today because it's actually not burning hot in my room today, like, nowadays. It's getting cooler. Can't wait for fall to happen. I mean, the current top 20 is pretty volatile right now, mainly because it's not really about scale currently, it's just whoever's grinding the hardest. And it's a much easier to grind if you are an OP Tetris player, so... Okie dokie, where's my next opponent? Oh, here we go. Did you guys see how like matches in the, er the tournament earlier were getting decided immediately by like whoever like completed their four wide the fastest? That was so funny. <laughs> Like, even if you, like, make a 10 chain and, like, a 12 chain in Puyo, the animation lasts so long that you actually go through, like, a couple swaps, like, two swaps, before the animation finishes. So you have some time in Tetris to, like, build up a counter or something. Oh my gosh. But if you don't make counter the four wide in Tetris before it swaps to Puyo, you basically just lose. Nothing you can do. I wonder how people feel about that. How would Tetris ever be balanced though? I mean, you would have to 
change up its garbage system completely as it's something that has a logical flow of risk and reward. It doesn't currently. Safe. Oh wow, okay. Hopefully I can react to that as my trigger. Void? You mean like, Smash 4 Void? Yeah, I just want to Puyo 20th port for the Switch too, but then I'll be satisfied. It'll be fun playing Pierre Puyo with like your friends. It'll be cool if Pierre Puyo has online mode too. What? Does when does Void play Puyo Tetris? How come I've never seen him? How come he doesn't play with us? When has he played? On his streams? Where? Oh, hey, Secret, what's up? He's hiding. Oh, so wait, how do you know this information? Do you, like, go to his locals or something? There's, like, a lot of Smashers that know about Puyo Tetris. I know, like... Oh gosh. Esam? The Buzz? Uh, who else? I don't know, a bunch of people. Oh. Taco Fin. Does something? I don't know how to pronounce his name. But he also plays, well, he plays Tetris. I don't think he cares at all about Puyo. Actually, I don't think he cares about Tetris itself either. I remember going onto his stream and just like crushing him over and over with 4 wide, but like he just didn't notice anything about it. Then again, it was Tetris Friends, where like, uh, it's kind of hard to tell what other people are doing since the game doesn't update real time very well. So maybe there was that, but. Come on, reds! Give me reds! No! Oh no! Oh my gosh. Okay. Wait, I don't have a blue! Spinning! Oh wait, he's not they're not ready. Okay, cool. <laughs> when I become like a pro Smash 4 player, well, in my sparse amount of free time, I've been trying to practice Smash 4, but I don't know, it's just hard. My hands get tired very quickly, trying to hit all those inputs. After playing Puyo for so long, like, I don't know. I've just never played a game where it actually forces you to work out your hands super hard. Uh, like, I get worn out from playing Tetris too, you know? <laughs> Mewtwo King? Maybe. Like, I remember going to, um... I don't know. I'm aware that all these Smashers play Puyo Tetris, but I understand that they don't really have time to just play it casually. Like, I went to Dreamhack like two months ago and I had like I stole two TVs and threw up Puyo Tetris on both of them and like I don't know I was like waving to them like I saw Void and like Hbox and everyone else there and I was like hey come play Puyo and they just like walked on by because they had real games to play games that would make them real money well quote unquote real money I don't think Root Smash really makes people money right <laughs> well okay Let's not have this discussion right now, but yeah, their time is better spent better spent playing everything other than Puyo, so I don't know if they will be friends with me.
It makes me it makes me sad, but what can you do? Oh, next match. Like I had like the whole table to myself at DreamHack. And yeah, I just had the hardest time getting anyone to play Puyo with me. Like I was actually working hard to be outgoing too. Like what was going on? Yeah, maybe one day Puyo will have large prize pools. Honestly, that's really the only way to convince people to play because, I mean, doing things to support the community is a nice thing to say, but you gotta eat, you gotta take care of yourself, and you can't do that with just aimless passion or whatever, whatever I've been doing. <laughs> Oops. Uh oh, what? Spinning. There we go. Yo, waving people down and having them like turn me down and stuff, it was like the most like embarrassing experience. But like I did what I had to do to get people to try and play. I tried my hardest. Well, I'm very vulnerable right now. Oopsies. Gonna be bad. Oh. Is this good enough? Oh, you're getting strangers to play with you at your college? Wow, what college is this? I want to meet. I want to go over there. I want to make real friends. <laughs> Those Naruto cosplayers are really funny, but they were really into it. It made me happy. Yeah, Mom Momocon was pretty good. Oh, I have an announcement to make. So, you guys know how I was supposed to do a panel at Anime Week in Atlanta? Well, they cancelled it because I guess they don't care about Puyo as much as I thought they would. It was kind of weird because like, like, we were emailing back and forth and we were like, Oh yeah, let's make this panel a reality. We can turn dreams into truth. But then I got an email saying, Oh, unfortunately we were unable to fit your panel in their schedule. Um, if you're okay with it, we can make your panel like a backup one. And I was just like, F that, I don't care. We'll just not do the panel. So yeah, um, if you guys are in the Atlanta area and you're expecting something like Puyo related, this uh this weekend um it's not happening anymore but i think me and the rest of the puyo crew like me oz seth and uh jmv we're all still going to hang out so if you're gonna be there you can still play like on our switches or something but yeah no more panel because we got to get over what a surprise, right? Puyo always gets the short end of the stick, and it never gets any respect from the greater gaming community. But I refuse to give up. I don't know. I'll apply for another panel at MobileCon next year. Hopefully, we'll have better luck then. Yeah, there's other cons, so... The thing is, I was already kind of wary about working with Anime Week in Atlanta because they totally shafted us last year. So what happened was, they were just super disorganized and they couldn't get like their like setup correct last year. 
Spinning. Oh wow, those are big harassment. So like our panel is delayed by like 30 minutes. And then not only not only did they screw over, screw us over by delaying our panel by that much, they then had to cut it short because there was like a panel afterwards that was um R18. And they're like, oh, um, we have to clear out this room. This is an R18 panel. And I'm just like, can't they wait? Don't they have all night? And they're like, oh no, we have to start on time. And I'm like, what? You didn't start us on time. But there was no fighting it really. So we had to give up. I don't know, I was really angry. So I had already had doubts about working with them, but I don't know. I was bright and full of hope and I was thinking, well, maybe it'll be different this year. Maybe. Turns out it wasn't different. Um, I don't know why I hesitated. <laughs> oh my gosh. I hate them so much, Tucker. Yes, I just said that on stream and they'll hear if they ever bother to watch my backlog, but I don't care. It's not fair what they did to us. Go out and continue the panel outside? Hmm, maybe I should get a toilet seat too, then I could evoke like, you know, the melty spirit, become true poverty. <laughs> God, I hate this world. Did you guys know that? I don't know. <laughs> I guess it just sucks getting screwed over so many times. Whoa, that was a great one chain. Wow. I'm impressed. Yeah, I still had fun too. I mean, with your friends, even the biggest, like, you know, slap to the face doesn't hurt. As long as you have your friends with you, you know? At least that's what anime tells me. So, no panel this weekend. Let's go in there to have fun. I think... I don't know if I want to bring my Switch or just bring like my 3DS with Puyo Chronicle on it. It seems a lot more fun. Like, we can grind dungeons together or something. Or we could play Parapuyo, but that you need Puyo 20th for that. Hmm. Are they gonna set up the chain yet? Okay, that cuts early. I have a little bit of time. Okay, this is a bad example to do. Blue! Wait, oh wait! Oh, cutting it. Oh yeah, those drunk guys, I remember that! That was. I don't know what they were doing. Honestly, the more I keep recalling these memories, the more I realize that there was like really suspicious things going on. That should have cued me into like accepting that I was being ran totally like like I don't know crap show. Sorry, I see bad words, but yeah, Just so many things were wrong. <laughs> Sorry, you don't see it on camera, but I'm like fighting to hold tears back. Tears of complete sadness and rage. Oh, is this tail gonna be good enough? We wanted to take an SNES setup. <laughs> Stun to. I can't remember, did the guys, those guys even really know anything about Puyo Puyo? I don't think they did, right? Hmm. 
I don't know, I've gone into repress memory mode about AWA, so you'll have to remind me. Oh, hey Anthony, what's up? Well, hopefully my my Puyo Puyo Tetra speed run gets accepted at AGDQ. Although I know in my heart the people running AGDQ will only accept it because it has Tetris in it. I'm hoping, I don't know, going there will give me a platform to convince people to play Puyo some more. That's like my last remaining hope for this world. Like maybe, just maybe, these people there will have decency to give Puyo a chance. I look past the Tetris exterior to see a great puzzle game within. Well, dang it. Oh hey Bonnie, what's up? How you doing? How's life? Mm, okay. Um wait, is that um is that a transition? It is. <gasps> wait! No, don't lag! Oh, oh, oh gosh. And extend with this, but I think this chain should be long enough. I think they're trying to build up a harassment or something. So I preempted them. What are the dots in the top left of the screen? Oh, I don't have any music playing. That's weird. It's supposed to say what soundtrack is playing. Oh. I realize I don't actually have a lot of Puyo music on this playlist. Oh yeah, they're setting up a Puyo tourney. I want to help them out. I really love the folks in Puzzle General. They're just like so open-minded and great. You know? Oh man, I didn't mean to set this off. Oh my gosh. Save me! Okay, I'm dead. I can pretend to salvage it. I don't think it's gonna happen though. Mm. <sighs> puzzle General? Um, there's a Discord server that plays just like a variety of puzzle games. Although most of the people there specialize in Panel de Pawn. But they do lots of interesting stuff too, like Wario Woods and Dr. Mario. The people there are really great and chill. I like them. Oh, oh no! I don't like this. Okay, hopefully this is good enough. Oh wait, what? That's full. Okay, time to pray. Is this good enough? Oh, you're SNES, bro. Oh no, I'm blue, bro. 
Your SNES broke? Oh, that sucks. Mine's like about to like break too. Like it just doesn't like the contact it makes so like the reader or whatever on the inside is not very good anymore. So you have to wiggle it a bunch of times for it to like load up a game. It sucks. It's like the more I touch it, the more I'm afraid it'll finally break forever. So then I end up not playing it at all. <laughs> I'm just so scared. Oh god dang it. Oh wow, the trigger is so safe though. Oh no, I should react faster. I couldn't tell whether that was a 4 or the full chain. I don't know, I was reading too slow. I was like, should I finish the extension or try to counter it? But then it was like a 4, so like, well, well I can't counter it. But then I tried to extend, but I thought too late, so <laughs> I just died. Hmm? The more I touch it, did I say that? I meant the more I thought of it. Oh, oh. How am I gonna extend? Wait, those greens can't be there. Okay. Hope this is good enough? I don't think so. I'm having doubts. Oh no, those greens don't work. Oh no! What? Wait, what? Oh, you're gonna import Chronicles? Hey, I'm really glad you got your how so you're using the Wi-Fi capture, right? Is it working pretty well? Cause I know you need like pretty stable like home Wi-Fi connection for the Wi-Fi capture to work well. Has it been stable? I'm just curious. I wonder if they'll try to like... Oh, wait. Will they beat me still? No, no, they cut. I think I'm safe. From what I saw from Kirby Stream, like, the quality looked pretty good too, like, um, it wasn't like blurry or anything, I think. It's really nice. It'll be great to have more people streaming Puyo Chronicle. I love you so much, Dad. <laughs> you don't know how much it means to me to see other people streaming Puyo in any form. Oh, you beat your friend in Puyo Puyo Tetris matches, who has the... 10,000 plus, 11,000 plus reading. Really? Wow! I'm definitely proud of you. Although, what I really want to know is how do you fare against people who are in our advanced and expert brackets in our tournaments? Because doing well at Tetris, like, I mean, that's cool. 
but I'm more interested in your Puyo versus Puyo skills. Hmm? Do you want more Do you want viewer matches when you do Puyo Tetris? Well that's easy. If you just go into the Puyo Discord, I'm sure this is usually someone that's available to play. So it'll be fine. Just ask there. Huh? Thankful that I retweeted your stream. Hey, no problem. Why does that Versus 2 have local multiplayer? I don't know. I think that was a feature one at one point, but we just never added it in. I don't know. Hmm? Well, if you don't mind me asking, Rookie, where do you like? What state do you live in? I'm sure there's something. Like if you look up, I don't know. Try looking up local FGC soft. Usually, you can find something on Facebook. I think that's where like most gatherings are handled. You might be able to find something um, if you search it that route. That's how I found the local like fighting game stuff in where I live. And we started bringing Puyo Puyo Tetris there. Hey, snowboard Lucy! Haha, <laughs> poop emoji! Puyo tournaments in Texas. Um. Well, Potion lives in Tetris, so you can play with them, I don't know. I'm not aware of like fighting game scenes in every state, so I wouldn't be able to tell you off the top of my head. But if you want help, I can definitely help you like search for things. What? Puyo Chronicles 50% off right now? That's amazing! The, ro the normal version or the anniversary box? Oh, did I say that? My bad, I meant Texas. Sorry. Hey, you should buy it. I mean, the anniversary box was kind of nice, but like, I don't know. You don't really need the trauma CDs. <laughs> Sorry guys, it's just Tetris has been dominating every aspect of my life in a pretty horrible way lately. It's like all I ever think about and I don't want to. So I just like slipped out. Oops. Yeah, brainwashing. <laughs> Huh? What's up, Kyle? Sorry, chat moves kind of... You want to rage quit Chronicles? Oh, my ratings dropped by like 300 points before, but like I don't really mind it. It's a chance to fight players I don't usually get to play, since the real Japanese Puyo scene is on Puyo Chronicle and not Puyo Tetris. So like, I'm not worried too much about your ratings. As long as you're above 2000, you get the chance to fight some really amazing players, and you can learn from them. So just don't worry about it too much. Oh, I have a match. Cool. I forgot to hit enter. I mean, um, uh, plus on the pro controller. Is this good enough? Maybe. Oh, Shiro is personally teaching you? That's great! What happened? Hey, is this weird? I think Shiro is like the cutest person ever. If I ever wanted to say a lame line like, I want to protect their smile, I would say I would want to protect Shiro's smile. Just saying. Hopefully that's not creepy. Ugh, I 
can't chain well. Wait, oops. <sighs> I just waited for them to commit to something that was dangerous, and then I saw my crappy chain. Surviving? No, they can wait. Take that. No, stop it. Die already. Huh? Consistent 11 days before his swaps. Wait, what's the simile for Western Puyo friend? Puyo fans? Have you ever heard of chronostasis? It's like this uh, physiological effect that happens when you know, like you move your eyes really fast. So like, have you ever looked up at the clock and like, I felt like the second hand wasn't moving? That's because when you move like your eye that fast or whatever, like your brain or I guess your visual system doesn't keep up with it properly. So like it creates a filler moment in front of your eyes of the same image you just saw for like extra split second. So yeah, I mean, if you guys just look a little too closely, it seems like the swap timer isn't going down, but actually it is, so yeah, don't worry about it. This is bona fide swap mode right here. Spinning! <laughs> No! Oh, hey, Sigur, what's up? Oh, man. That wasn't decisive. What shall I do? Hey, I don't think I mean I don't think I said this enough yet, but I'm really thankful you drew the um the art for the fan art contest uh secret. It's so nice. Honestly Um How do you even pronounce your name? Undying? Undine? Undies? Well whatever her name is. I think she's one of the best Coolest like designs of Puyo Quest, but uh, I don't know. Don't tell that to Yuman. He hates uh that character with a passion. Just because people bring it into like multi, like multi like party quests for like the fear status, but there's so many other characters that do fear for like better. <laughs> he hates when people use her. Say, 
Call, can you get to the fan art contest info again? Um, okay. Let's see. Gosh, I have too many columns in my tweet deck. Can't even find like the Puyo Nexus tab. Where is this? Oh, here you go. Oh wait, the match started. Hey, I really like this version of Arl's theme. It's like kind of goofy. Oh? Why did they stop moving? They could have just demolished me. They didn't have to have that kindness on me. Follow up. No, they got the yellows. This is dangerous now. Oh, one more piece. Uh, <laughs> or actually, yeah, this is for Battle Monogatari. Yeah, surprisingly, a lot of Puyo tracks it seem like they're like mostly iconic for where they appear, right? Like this track, it's, you just think of Puyo Puyo Sun, right? But actually, it was from Mado Mado Monogatari. It's so cool finding out things like that. Uh, it's gonna be too risky. I don't care. Go. Is that a four? Oh no, the blue! They cut! Oh no! Don't notice it, please. Don't get yellows. Oh, cool! Yeah. Um, just as planned. <laughs> All according to Kaku. Yeah. You don't regret it, but they're kind of funny, right? Just how ridiculous they can be. Oh yeah, Waku Waku Puyo Puyo Dungeon is the one. I like that one too. Well, I just don't know enough Japanese to play it. I ever guess Platoon 2? Why is the Puyo so glitchy when spectating? It's because of the way it's set up, like... The way it gets the board state is like, whatever the player send. But it's also, I don't know... Some hackish way, you also get the replay system to work. So, for some reason, wheels are all glitchy sometimes. It's hard to explain. I don't really understand how Hernan did it, but it works. You can play Puyo. Oh, wait, we did play Salmon Run. Sorry, because we don't, we don't play enough, okay? Let me try to like cover up or talk my way out of this like grievous forgetfulness that I just showed. Uh Yo, you need to like join us, like me, Tucker and Yuman when we do leagues together. 
so fun. All of the meta ladies, the meta lately is kind of really annoying. So I don't know. They buff the baller and like splash out so much. Like that's all you ever see in ranked anymore. Like I could, like I was like actually going up the ranks today because I was like using the Luna Blaster against everyone. Like this is too good. <laughs> Like, today they were running Rainmaker, so my strategy was to just like... Being of the baller is like, it's basically indestructible now, unless you have three people shooting at it. So what I did was, I just used the baller and rolled the path straight to the Rainmaker, like, Rainmaker goal for my team, and we won. And there was nothing the opposing team could do about it because like, the baller blast radius is gigantic and... Totally misleading. <laughs> so they just like stood there and died. It was so unfair, I felt bad. But, I don't know. It's not my responsibility to fix Splatoon. Gosh, what track is playing? Spinning! Hmm. That never be bad as broken as Kraken or Bubble of Friends between one. Yeah, I keep hearing people saying that, so they, they just like accept the brokenness of Grace because it's like it could be worse. I don't know how I feel about that attitude. That's how people think about Puyo versus Tetris, and it's still bad. But people are okay with accepting the status quo instead of fighting for justice. So. I don't know, I just don't think it's fair when like it requires a full team of people to just kill one person using their special. Like, there's none of the other specials are like that. <laughs> oh my gosh, I'm not building this counter very well. Oh darn. Oh, it wants now? So, can you guys tell me again what the bubbler was? It was basically like a shield that came out instantly, right? So it was like the ultimate panic button that always got you killed or something because like... You couldn't really predict when the bubbler would come out. And since, you know, you're already trading shots, like suddenly, like, they require more one more hit skill than you do, so then you lose the trade. Is that how it worked? Huh? I don't have to give you the PN tag, you can just add it yourself. It's totally public domain for now. <laughs> The one thing I want to try is like the Echo Locator. I feel like being a sniper would be so much more- Oh man, this music is loud. I feel like being a sniper would be so much rid more ridiculous if you had an Echo Locator. Cause like, I saw, I saw a video of it and basically it just tells you the positions of everyone on the whole field, right? That's so broken. Like what's the point anymore if you've been hiding? But it's fun though. I feel like chargers need a buff, honestly. Like, you have to put in so much work just to be good with them. But, like, you can sometimes accomplish the same results with other weapons, so I don't really know.
Squiffer plus all sub saber? <laughs> what? Point sensors. Eh. I don't know, my dream is to become the most elite sniper ever. But I know I'm trash at sniping, so that's never going to happen. Not dang it. Wait, is there another patch? Although the last patch was like the like the baller in Splashdown buff. What happened next? Wait, what happened to Chargers? I haven't been keeping up with the news honestly, so. Oh, whoa. Good thing I got the double yellows. Oh yeah, I've tried the Rapid Blaster Pro. It's pretty fun, but like, I feel like... I don't know. The whole struggle with the Rapid Blaster is that you need to get all of your shots to connect. And like, that's kind of hard when the first hit, that doesn't kill. Like, I don't know, it alerts the person that they're being shot at, so they start moving, and then it gets really hard. So I try using it, but I'm really bad compared to like using other blasters. Okay, give me yellow so we can harass. Okay, I committed too long. This is gonna be so bad. No. What? How did this still win? You know, I was like stuck at um I was stuck at like A minus in both tower control and rainmaker until like I practiced using the Luna Blaster with Yumon in League the other day. Now I'm actually doing really well. I feel kinda scummy, but whatever. No one can fault me for playing the meta, right? <laughs> Oh yeah, I heard about the quick respawn nerf. I definitely agreed that that was for the better, because of the way it like didn't really encourage like fighting and surviving. Since trading was like highly more like outcome two. Hey, you know what? Do you guys want to league up for Splatoon? I don't know. I kind of feel like playing it now, now that we're talking about it. Hmm, I don't think I've actually heard the song for Puyo Fever go on that long. I always quit Endless Mode because I get bored really quickly. <laughs> uh. Such a terrible Puyo player. Oh. Say, 
Water They're not ready. Hmm. There's a lot of people who want to play. Maybe we should just do Turf War. I definitely want to get more experience with using blasters since they're the meta, so... I have to say, Fever 1 brings back so many memories. Thus the days when you will play Fever all alone, but free, without being harassed to death. Yeah, the Diamond Cutie days. Yo, hey! If I ever make an esports team, can I commission like one of you guys? Have you guys seen the Diamond Dogs logo for Metal Gear Solid 5? I want a Diamond Cuties logo <laughs> in the same style. <laughs> I've been trying to photoshop it myself, but like, um, I, I suck at photoshop. I don't know, I just think it'll be really funny. <laughs> diamond dogs, diamond keys. Oh darn it! I can't survive this! Okay, after this match, I'll look up Splatoon, I guess. I'm gonna play for a while. I wanna get good at using blasters. You know, after the tri Sloster nerf, it kinda opened up a whole new world for me. I was like, wow, I actually need to get better at other weapons. So then I started using all sorts of things. Splatoon 2 became so much more fun for me. Okay, guess it's time to switch, right? Uh... <laughs> okay, uh... Okay, gotta change my stream title. Splatoon 2 with the Puyo family! Exclamation point, exclamation point, exclamation point! Huh? That was so fast. It's because I always have Splatoon 2 open now that I don't play Puyo Tetris anymore. <laughs> I'm sorry. Okay. Wait, I need to check if there's any good clothes first. I feel like I'm behind on like the clothes meta. I really want to get something with like more Ink Saber mains, Ink Saber subs, and like uh, I don't know. Opening gamut, quick respawn. Ooh, this looks nice. Special Saber. Wait, no. I don't care. Hmm? All special charge up. This is kind of good. Ooh, nice. Do I use Splatnet too? Um, I don't know. I know you can buy equipment off of there, but I've been too lazy to do it properly. And it's so expensive too. 
Since the Luna Blaster is hard to grind special with, but the baller is so essential, I kind of want to do this. Okay. Two special ops. Alright, you guys ready? More common abilities? Well, uh, I know that's a thing, but I'll just take my chances. <laughs> The thing is, like, I don't really understand my own playstyle for Splatoon 2 yet, so I don't know what good weapons are, like, what good ability sets I want. And I don't want to, like, I don't know, grind a ton and max out. I mean, for me, there's like two options right now, since I don't know what I want. It's don't care and play suboptimally, or just get tons of gear and grind everything on them. And just have clothes for every situation or weapon I use. Oh, two of you guys got in! Wow! Okay, I'll show you guys my Luna Blaster skills. Wait, is my bit rate good enough for this? Oh, okay, I'm good. Okay, going straight for the kills. Oh, I'm an art baller? How? I can win. Oh, what? There we go. Oh, wow. They'll still kill me afterwards. Wait, isn't it supposed to clear bombs that are hitting me? Hmm. Or maybe bombs that come out from specials are different. Whoa, what? what was that? Oh. Oh, Splash Jam clears bombs so other things don't? Okay. Oh no! Save me! I can't deal with both of you guys sniping me. Oh. Uh, what do I do? Oh my gosh. I couldn't do anything. I'm sorry for my team. We're not making a lot of progress. So you guys are just like holding position too well. Wow. Well, nothing I do about that. Ah! What? Hmm, maybe using a blaster in turf war is a bad idea. I'm not having second thoughts now. Oh, whoops. Like, I just can't even progress. <laughs> no, come on! Let's go! Oh, I didn't get the direct hit! <laughs> Did you just see how th all three of them were shooting at me? <laughs> that was too sad. <laughs> I'm so bad at this game.
Huh? Ink my spawn. But like... What can we do? We need to scout the other people though. I mean, I feel like I shouldn't be the one you can despawn. I'm a blaster. What can you really do? <sighs> I'll just have to hope and pray that like my teammates are the ones who are able to like create space for us. Wow, both of you guys on the other team again. Darn. How did you beat my baller? That's so crazy, what? Ah, oh, dang it. I should have walked forward. Didn't reach far enough. No. Huh? I don't know the correct way to turf war. Whatever. Sorry, I'm bad at Splatoon. Okay. <laughs> I know I'm trash. But I'm grateful for the help. We're fine? Okay. Oh, I'm fine, okay. <laughs> oh, well, it is that splatter shot who has a lot less than everyone else. Is it their fault? We haven't played on Mansa Maria yet. What's up this RNG? Oh! Updated. Get in guys, get in!
on. No, my friends! How do I get out of this without the game banning me? Well, I guess I'll have to try my best with these strangers. Hey, don't fight with okay, you guys. They're just uh, just looking to have different strategies, I guess. after me. Coming from that side. Oh! No! I jumped into it! Well, I'm an idiot. Oh, what? Oh, I can't jump up walls! I suck! go. At least I got them before I died. Like, I knew there was no hope of getting out there alive, so at least it took them out. Oh, whoa! Wow, that arrow space really did it. Okay, I need to assess the situation. Where is everyone? I guess the arrow space... I guess I'll just not. There we go. No, our shooting! It didn't kill him! The Aeros meta is back. Yeah, because the baller got buffed, right? And well, Curling Bomb Rush is always pretty OP. Oh. Did I get killed? Did I deny that, guys? Whoa! Why is there so many bombs? I used it too early. Oh, that was useless. I mean, I, yeah, the general strategy, I believe, is, I mean, like, in your spawn, let's still try to prioritize going to the middle. But I feel like the prioritization, the prioritization between inking your spawn and going to the middle, like, that, it's like a sliding scale that changes based on what weapon you have. Like, if you have an arrow spray, I can understand inking your spawn, because, like, you'll get your special again really fast, and then you can go to the middle and do some real work, like kill some people. But like if you're a blaster, like you're not gonna help very efficiently by eating your spawn. So you should just only ink what you can, but still rush to the middle more. Oh no! 
I tried to shoot downwards, but it didn't work. Is that like delayed the bagging or something? Jumped out really fast. All right, I assisted with that kill. I felt pretty good about that. Oh. No! How did they get the hat? I bought it off of the Etsy from Tucker's girlfriend, Rebecca. Um, if you want it, go ask Tucker in the video Discord. Where did he go? I couldn't get the direct hit there. How are you dodging my bomb? No, stop popping up out of nowhere! Yeah, it just, it's just much easier to use a blaster when it's like a rank mode where you have an objective. So people can't just like hide forever in one spot and hold a position. <laughs> I feel like I'm really letting my team down by not being able to like kill enough people. Is that quick super jump? Okay, I can do this. Oh, two arrow sprays. What can we really do? Here. No, this got both of us. That one, that one blast didn't get him. It hit the wall instead of exploding. 
Oh man. Oh, you disconnected. Is that why we're struggling? No! What can I do? They're all right there. This isn't a fight I can do alone. Where's my teammates? You know, maybe I should stop using this blaster. To use a real turf war weapon. Maybe. Okay, I'm switching weapon, guys. If you stay in the same room, I'll try joining up again, okay? Hey, I got in. Whoa, you're sniping so fast. What, is there another disconnect? Oh, this means we actually have a chance against... Oh my gosh, stupid splash wall. I thought, I thought it was in front, they were in front. Well, we're still losing even though it's 3v4, so... Well, let's see how fast Seer can just snipe. Did you know that's where you land if you try to use your special inside the ink rail? I'm worth minus one team member. Because I'm useless? I'm sorry. Oh, 
That doesn't come away. Oh no! Wow, we still lost BB1. Wonder what happened. chance no I wanted to get that one shot in oh I think we lost even though they had like one team member missing what happened How did I lose? I don't understand. Huh? Oh well. Oh no! I suck! Wow, all hitting shield, what can they do? Wow, we just like lost our lead. What? I should have threw a bomb down instead, just as a distraction. Oh!
God damn it. Oh wait, there's a wall there now? I must have been playing too much rain. I'm so bad. I didn't help out at all. Mm, how am I doing? I'm doing alright. It's just very crushing to realize that I'm not actually that good at Splatoon. <laughs> I want to be good as everyone else. Wow, it keeps going off. Whoa! I don't think they knew that I was there, but they were just like shooting and I like, ran into it. Oh, I'm, I'm dumb. When will I ever get a Splatoon? here. Oh no! Flash down is so fast now, what can you really do about it? That was pretty good. Oh, 
Oh, you know there's a problem with Saker has more ink turf with a sniper rifle. <laughs> that means I wasn't playing properly. Oh, was I killing them? I don't know. bomb rush already. Oh, at least it got Joseph back after he sniped me. You were aiming at me, wow. Um, hey guy, uh, let's go. You guys are just so good at holding position. I tried, I guess. Okay, let's go.
Ah! I was trying to get both of you guys. Maybe I should have threw a bomb down. Maybe we, you would react to that too. So maybe that wouldn't work. I don't know. It'd be safer to jump to. base. Is the person capable of fighting them all? Oh, there you go. Oh, it's Yuzu. It's Yuzu. Never mind. I can always come on you. You guys are so fast at sniping. Up there. No one on the left though. Oh, dang it. Didn't account for that person right there though. Always looking. Uh oh, we might lose it. What the heck? Well, I guess I was useless in these final moments. Thanks for playing with us, Sayaker. <laughs> hey, don't worry about it. We'll have more fun next time we uh, play together. Dodged them all alone. I had no one like doing the cover. Okay, um, well, nothing to do about the sloshing machine, like taking out this area. Ah, no, I gave away my position and then they got out of range. That sucked. That means players are scary. I was shooting at them, but then we moved out the way. Yeah, I think we can like... We jump back to the base so they can use Tetsu in the way. Oh no!
Okay, that was a useless death. Are they about to jump over to that side? Uh oh, they're about to get ganged up on. No! Okay, it's time we just run forward. Hey, that was pretty good. Hmm, the arrow spray meta is really real. <laughs> Look, the guy even got more kills than all of us. My bomb didn't get them. Well, at least, I don't, I don't know. Almost got the third hit in. Oh, we have to take care of this person on our base, right? Wow, nothing I could do. They'll take care of that. No. Hmm, 
the leaderboards to Puyo Tetris? I mean, yeah. This is because since the rating cap got increased, the Puyo players have a reason to try really hard. They might not be able to be Tetris, but you're still making some sort of progress, I guess. Uh, I'm just no good at Splatoon. Okay, I'll do one more and then I'm done for tonight. Wait, what? Oh, well, Secret, we can keep playing if you want some rounds in. Because I haven't played with you in like, I don't know. When was the last time I played with you? Oh yeah, it is 11 p.m. I don't know. How much do you want to play? Because I don't particularly have anything to go to sleep early for. I just kind of want to, so I like, to stop hating my poor health. Oh no! Who's shooting me? Took care of this flatling that was shooting at me. Oh, I want to get some head on. How did that happen? Oh, he, he, he was coming for me. I try to get him to beat in between charges, but I guess it charges pretty fast. Oh, I've never, we've never played before? Oh, then let's just keep going until you get in. Let's at least get one match together. Then I'll be satisfied with playing with everyone tonight. Oh. Wow, they were waiting for me. Oh, well, the time they wasted waiting for me, they could have, I don't know, I don't know, eat more turf down there. Hopefully, that was helpful of me. Bomb! Pretty helpful. So, Secret, you're able to join the room, right? Oh, ten minutes? Uh, okay. improve on I guess I'm getting better at aiming just like 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 that I think 
I think I need to get better at like, I don't know, understanding the situation, where I should be moving. It still like runs my death a lot. I don't like that. Gonna get us an eighth person. Hmm. How come the guy won't let me shoot him? Well, my teammate will take care of them. I think. Oh, there's someone behind us. Wow, they go far! Wow! You must have predicted where I was going to go, huh? Wait, how did you guys cover the middle so fast? I thought I was like... When did this happen? I ran right into that splat lane. I only got two shots in. Pretty good. Nice. Wow, how did you get so many kills with the blaster? One day I want to become a dangerous player, but I don't know, I still die too easily.
Hmm, Spileys are outclassed by everything in the current meta. I don't know, I feel like they're not too bad. Especially the Deco one. Because, like, having Splash Ball really helps protect you when you have to, like, you know, stand out of the open and shoot. And like, I was playing with Yumon the other day, and actually Splash Walls are like, uh, super useful for blocking up choke points in ranked. They just throw a wall down and like, rip, you can't jump across this gap anymore with the Rainmaker. Charging special so fast. Oh no! Okay, that's dangerous. I'll try not to pick that fight. Oh, whoa! He almost got me. Oh! Zap from that far. Yeah, okay, I can't jump to that. I'll probably die. Oh no! That was helpful. Oh, uh, 11.30 is fine. We can do that. Oh no, we're so close! 1.1% away. Oh, that Octobrush brush got a lot of turf and more kills than me. <laughs> I suck. you.
okay, the PN team is here. We got this, right? There's a disconnect on your team. No wonder why it was so easy. Oh, it was you, Secret. <laughs> Dang. I was like, wow, I'm surviving way too long. Like, no one's taking me out. I'm a lot worse. So, so like, I don't know. I didn't expect to be living so long. Down the middle, okay.
Can't fight that. Oh, wow. Hmm. Whoa. Well, that was really smart. Wait, did you disconnect? No. What will we do? Oh my gosh. There is no hope in running, really. Oh my god! They're just covering the landing with suction bombs, so I can't even go that route. No. I can't even escape the spawn at this point. It's too hard with just three people. Hmm, did something. No. Oh wow. Shouldn't have charged in alone. My teammates are inking the spawn. Oh nice of them. Hit me. Oh, the jet squelchers from so far away.
on, I was trying to get you! That was good. Huh? Salty about what? Sixteen hundred. Uh, how long? Look how much I got. Oh wait, I did get sixteen hundred. Never mind. Only, only got two kills. The jet squelcher is considered a defensive weapon. Can I get all? There was no way I was going to win that trade. Oh no! You came for me! Get him, Trailblazer! Get secret! Did you? Oh, you lost. Oh no! That was good enough.
Hey, if you change weapons fast enough, I think you'll still get in. Filling up. Oh, you got in still. <laughs> wow. Got you, I got you from all the way over there. Nice. Oh no. I'm coming from the left. machine's going really far. The situation. All back at our base. Did they get taken out? Range? I was just outside of your range. Oh, Sarge, what's up? Hey, our team killed it. Nice. What will I get? Oh, run speed up! You know, isn't it supposed to be 5x run speed up for Rockenberg? <laughs> I only got one. What's that luck? Hey, isn't this regular battle just like all of us? <laughs> I like that. Just got off work? Hmm, you work pretty late. Oh, 
Oh, all of you guys are on the other team. Okay, I'll try my best. Oh, that's a very dangerous sloshing machine. Oh no! over there, but we need to tear these guys first. Ah, I was surrounded. Everyone's hiding way too well. I'm not sure what I'm supposed to do here. Sloshing me out of the air. What's with your aim? Hey, Harpoon, what's up? Oh, you missed me playing swap mode earlier. It was really intense. Gotta get better at textures, you know? That's the only thing that matters in this world. Man. Ah, oh, it's so awful. No, I refuse. We can't lose like this. We won? How? Oh, you disconnected. <laughs> hmm, even with your disconnection, we just barely won, though. I told you guys how much I really appreciate my Puyo family. I don't know. It brightens up my day to know that everyone working hard to, you know, advance the Puyo community. Just being fans does a lot, you know? I guess two more and then we're done. Kidoki, come on, one more person. Who is blue? I have no idea.
Wow, I had to jump to my death in front of an Aqua Brush. That was nice. I'm an idiot. Wow, why can't I get third hit in? I suck. The Ink Star must have held the carbon roller to get me to get that one shot. Mm, oh, what? I'll leave it up to them to observe. Let me see if I can fight people. Oh no! What? That got both of us? There's just over there somewhere. Oh no! Ah! I only got two shots in! Why is there. was um domination right there what happened oh, I got no kills I didn't get much turf either I'm sorry I let the team down Think it'll be nerfed? What if, like, what if uh, Nintendo just buffs it? I wouldn't put it past them doing that. <laughs> A lot more of your friends you hang out with are starting to get Puyo Tut. Well, that makes me happy too. More people should be playing it. Definitely hope people. I definitely hope pe more people buy the game, whether or not they actually play Puyo. Well, that's outside of my control, but I'll just secretly judge people. I can do that at least. Oh my god! How was he fighting the Octo Brush? I got so lucky there. I'm pretty sure that I was going to die because it was like obvious one on one.
out too far. Oh, well, I was walking into death either way. I guess I have to fix this. Oh no! Wait. Wow, nothing I can do. Ah! It was hard finding two people at the same time. Well, that was hopeless. I don't know why I tried jumping. Oh, we're all we've all been taken out. What can we do in the last 22 seconds? I don't think we got it. Wait, what? Hmm, maybe. Actually, nah. Yeah. Oh, we got. You have to go. All right. Okay. See you later, Joseph. It was fun. Ooh, what ability will I get now? Oh, very useful. I think. Just one of them. Last one, guys. Time to make history. Life will change. Reach out to the truth! The truth! I tried to escape, but... I think it's safe to jump in, right? Everyone's diverging. I'll support the... Oh. It's safe to jump in, but well, maybe I'll turn this way. Throw a oh! Somehow I survived that!
No. I felt kind of rude at the end to inkjet both of the, their spawn at the same time. <laughs> Alright, thanks for playing everyone, that was fun. It's really fun playing Splatoon with everyone in Puyo next in the Puyo community. It makes me super happy. You know, I like playing Puyo a lot, but doing things that we can do like together. Like all of us at once? It's pretty fun too. I like Splatoon and Jackbox. I think those are my favorite things to do like as a party. Alright, that was cool. Oh, let me scrub my gear before I forget. How do I go- how do I walk through this plaza like faster? I don't really like this headgear either. Make it clean. Guys, oh wait, I wonder if anyone's playing Puyo Tetris right now. I love supporting the Puyo community. Actually, the Tetris community. Salmon Run or League Battle? Yo, yeah, let's do that. I want to do Rainmaker together. I love Rainmaker, it's fun. Like it's not like tower control where like you're struggling for five minutes, you know you're going to lose, and there's not really much you can do about it. At least in Rainmaker, uh, the game has a decency to make you lose in like two minutes, <laughs> so you don't have to keep fighting. <laughs> what curse? I don't know. I kind of like it. Oh hey, so there's this one streamer called Sirdine Pro. He talks really big all the time, saying so he beats everyone. Like, I don't even, I don't think, I don't remember him like beating everyone or like him actually playing Puyo Tetris that much at all. But it's like, I'm the best. If I had gone to this tournament, I would have like beaten everyone or whatever. I have no idea. But hey, let's watch him. Here's his link. Okie dokie. Bye guys. You know, I might ask this guy to fight just so I can, uh, I don't know, see what he's truly made of. <laughs> Okay, bye.